and gentlemen, welcome to this episode of Mr. Main Event Starts. As you can see, I'm out here with my boy, the D-Line. Now, there's a lot of wrestlers out there. They sell their t-shirts, and that's a good thing, you know. We should support our indie wrestlers. But D-Line does something different. You guys give away the t-shirts, and you know, I just want to talk about that. Um, how did this come about? What made y'all decide to be different by giving away the shirts rather than... First and foremost, man, I mean, we got to give a shout-out to D-Line Nation, man, because D-Line Nation, without y'all, man, we wouldn't be the where we at right now. But uh, we came about that, um, you know, we was at a show one day, you know, and we was like, you know what, without them, there is no us. So therefore, you know what I'm saying, we want to give back to the community. That's what means, that, that, that means everything to us, is giving back, you know what I mean, and uh, showing everybody that we can make a difference, you know what I'm saying, we do care. So that's what we do, we give back, you know what I mean, and uh, support, the, support the community. Yeah, man, the thing is, you know, we understand that it's hard times right now for families, so $10, $15, $20 for a t-shirt, you know, why not just give it away, you know, we all right. You know, we okay with funds or whatever, man, and there was kids out there who, I was one of them, you know, I grew up going to the shows like, oh man, I wish I could have a t-shirt, but all my parents had was the money for it was just to get us in to the show. But you know, man, we see the kids out there, they come up, oh, you know, can I have a shirt? How would I look like, oh, hey, do you got $10? You know, right. You know, <laughs> right. We just gave the shirts away to the kids or whoever, but you know. We just do that, man, from a standpoint to where we came from poverty. You know how hard it is to come across money. So, you know, it's just like... So, can you guys... Know, I, I never forget one show we were at. We were at a show, and what happened was uh, we were giving out the T-shirts. And uh, later on that day, we got a tweet from one of our fans, and they said, you know what? I was having a bad day until right now. These guys, thank you for the T-shirts. You made my day. That right there is a huge part of what we do, man. That means a lot to us. And... Uh, you know, yeah, you know, we, we pay for the shows and stuff like that, but when you give back, you know, and see the difference that you're making on their face, that's a huge difference for us. I mean, we love it, man. All right, tell us about some of the other things before we wrap up. Some of the other things that D-Line does for the community and some of the things you guys have planned in the future for the community. Oh, man, we do a lot of things. I mean, we go to, uh, you know, schools, we talk to kids, you know, tell them to stay positive, you know what I'm saying, reach for your hopes and dreams, always believe. I mean, because that's what we had to do, you know, so we give back and feed back to those kids. Always stay positive no matter what the situation is. Um, you know, and what we do is whenever we have a big match, you know, we put together a field trip. We pay for, you know, uh, the buses, we pay for their tickets, and, you know, they, they, they ride with us and we go out and, you know, they, they get away from their problems, whatever they're going through, and get a chance to be a kid and enjoy, you know, their own life. That's what it's all about. Yeah, for a few hours, man, we just want to get those kids, man, off of the hardship that they going through at the house. Yeah. You know, because, like I said, you know, before, you know, growing up in a single parent home, it's not always, you know, great. So, the thing we try to do, man, even if we can't get the buses or whatever for the kids, what we try to do is, like, you know, get a couple of parents here, a couple of parents there, you know, if you want to come out to the show. You can bring the kids, it's free, you know what I'm saying? But sometimes we're not gonna have the big buses for a lot of the kids. And we can just get a few friends of ours, you know, with trucks or vans, we're trying to get them, you know, to help us out, bring out a few kids to the show, get their mind off of them, man. Because we understand what's going on in the uh, neighborhood. Right, everyone, thank you guys. Uh, let people know where they can find you. You can find us on Facebook yeah. at Black Ice Body Snatcher. It should come up like once you type in Black Ice Body Snatcher. That's our Facebook. You can also reach us on Twitter at D Line Black and Red. That's D Line D L I N E R D. I'm sorry. That's all right. It's right there on the screen. It's right there on the screen. It's on the screen. It's right there. It's right there. Right there. It's right there. It's D line B L K R E D. All right. Thanks, guys. I appreciate it. Hey, I was impressed. Hey, I'm a new one. I know what it is.